My name is Emma Ord Paulett and I'm the course leader for BSc Diagnostic Radiography here at Teesside University. Diagnostic radiographers are engaged with the medical imaging using different forms of radiation. So we work with people within a hospital setting and through a range of community sites as well. So it's looking at everything from X-ray through to CT, MRI and nuclear medicine. So here at Teesside University, our first year students begin in the academic environment and we give you all the tools to prepare you ready for your first clinical placement. We do that through teaching you regional anatomy, we teach you pathophysiology and we look at a lot of radiation safety as well in that first component, as well as giving you an introduction to professional working. You then go out into the clinical environment and have a long stretch out on clinical placement building up your basic radiographic knowledge and skills. You then move forwards into another clinical placement, which is the beginning of your second year. You then start building on your initial knowledge and skills that you've built through the first placement and start looking at more advanced modalities and imaging techniques. When you return to the academic environment at the end of second year, we start looking at the science underpinning those advanced modalities and looking into more complex imaging situations as well as beginning to introduce research methods. We then go into the third year and you continue in the academic environment looking at image interpretation and more complex situations still such as paediatric, oncology and major trauma. We then send you back out into the clinical environment for a final long placement so that our students are finishing in the clinical environment ready to hit the ground running when they are qualified professionals. So we use quite long clinical placement blocks at Teesside University. We send you out for approximately 14 week blocks which is the majority of a semester and as I previously mentioned you will have two clinical placements following on from each other, but you will have a break in between that as well as an opportunity for a four week elective placement at a destination of your choice. But in general, our placements are approximately 14 weeks long. We send our students out onto clinical placement across the northeast region. We're associated with major trauma sites such as the RVI in Newcastle and James Cook here in Middlesbrough. But we also send our students out round other sites such as Darlington and Durham. We are associated with a number of trusts across the North East, all of which have very close links with us here at the university. And we also allow our students to go out onto what's known as satellite sites to experience community radiography in the smaller settings as well. Whilst our students are in the academic environment, we engage with a number of different teaching methods so as well as our general purpose teaching rooms when we're able to offer delivered teaching and group work, we also have a fantastic lab here at the university where we teach clinical skills and get students hands-on with x-ray equipment. We also use a range of clinical simulation software including a software called ShaderWare that has been developed by my colleague Phil Cosson. So this software has been distributed around the country and it is something that we utilise to the best of our ability within the course. We've also recently had an exciting purchase of some MRI software allowing our students to better engage with those skills in the academic environment going forward. So it's a very exciting mix of different teaching and assessment methods at the university. Here at Teesside we have a diverse range of assessment methods including written exams and assignments and group work with practical and presentation content as well. What we look for in our applicants are people who come with that innate ability to care. Ultimately, diagnostic radiographers are healthcare professionals. We can teach you the technical skills that you need to know, but we ultimately need to know that you have a caring and empathetic nature that will let you thrive in the environment that is healthcare. The best part of the course here at Teesside University and the profession in itself is how diverse the end result is. As a diagnostic radiographer, your day-to-day -day work will never look the same twice. You get to work with a huge range of different people, advancing technology, current research and literature, and have a huge range of op options once you qualify. 
And that flexibility is truly reflected within this course, giving you the opportunity to explore what is interesting to you. In diagnostic radiography, you have a huge number of options once you qualify. So you can carry on working in the X-ray environment, which opens up your diverse range of day-to-day -day activities, but you can also specialise in different modalities such as MRI and nuclear medicine. And this can also open up a range of different options such as working on mobile screening vans, which are constantly increasing and improving. You can also go into medical sales if you have an interest in traveling around. Application specialists teach the radiographers at the site how to use this ever advancing and new equipment, as well as options such as research and education. So the possibilities really are endless with this career. If you'd like to find out more about diagnostic radiography, we'd love to see you at an open day.